I'm Airman First Class Michael Kantak, and this is your Misawa Radio Report. It's not uncommon to have a Navy change of command on land. Senior Airman Jonathan Guzman heads over to Misawa's Naval Air Facility for their 17th change of command. The band is in place. The bell is ringing. And Navy Captain Christopher Rodman is taking his final steps as the commander of Misawa's Naval Air Facility. It was a terrific ceremony. It, uh, it was fast and to the point. As Captain Rodman ends his command here in Misawa, it's hard not to remember some of the high points of his tour. Over the course of the three years, we hosted, um, I think, five or six P-3 squadrons for six months at a time. Now that's a major accomplishment because in 2011, Masawa's Naval Air Facility didn't have a flying squadron since 2007. But during his time here, Captain Rodman and his family made Masawa their home. The, the people of Masawa are welcoming and friendly and very much have made my family and I feel like part of their family and part of the, part of the town. So as his family sits front row during the reading of his orders, the command is officially turned over to Captain Keith Henry, who is thankful for the 300 sailors Captain Rodman is handing over. I really appreciate the hard work he's done here, uh, Captain Rodman has done here at the NAF Misawa. He uh, really set me up for success. Uh, he, he left me a fine working machine and I appreciate it. Prior to his new command here in Misawa, Captain Henry was an air and missile defense officer from the U.S. 7th Fleet and served as an air boss on the USS George Washington. Senior Airman Jonathan Guzman, Masao Air Base, Japan. Captain Rodman is headed to the National War College in Washington, D.C., where he'll serve as a faculty member. If you missed any of our news stories, check us out at misawa.afnpacific.net or on Facebook under AFN Misawa. That was your Misawa Radio Report. I'm Airman First Class, Michael Kantak.